You know, the battle at Jericho, glory to God, I've been waiting a week and a half to say this, so y'all act excited about it, all right. The battle at Jericho was not really about, I, I'm telling you, I've been, it's been like 11 days, y'all better get excited. It was not really about Israel conquering Jericho, it was about God conquering Israel. <laughs> I'm going to say that again because when you wait 10 days to say something, you get the right to do it twice. It wasn't about Israel conquering Jericho. It was about God conquering Israel. And I wonder how many of us are circling things, wondering, when am I going to defeat it? And God's in heaven saying, when am I going to defeat you? (laughs) When am I going to conquer this? And God's saying, when am I going to conquer? You see, God wasn't, oh glory, God wasn't wearing down Jericho. God was wearing down Israel. God wasn't shaking up Jericho. God was shaking up Israel. The apostle Paul had a thorn in his flesh, a physical problem that hindered him. And Paul went to God in prayer. This is a man that could raise the dead. This is a man that could heal the sick with his very shadow. This was a man who penned the word of God right out of the heart of heaven. And Paul said, God, I've got a problem. Will you take it away? And he prayed three times in the Holy Ghost and God never removed his problem because God wasn't trying to conquer Paul's thorn. He was trying to conquer Paul. 